great day. Uh, got a chance to fly around a lot. See some guy make some plays. See some guy happy to uh, be out there again uh, since the last game we played. You might talk about the difference between first day of spring this year and last year. I think I, as far as our defense, we're ahead. We uh, expect the calls and know what to look for. Uh, our transition in the, you know, on the field with the uh, communication is, is a lot better than last year. Uh, I think it's a, a whole different experience. So, man, how's Rudy Ford looked out there at safety so far? I mean, uh, he's a very talkative guy. Uh, he knows what's going on. Uh, he, he He's a learner. I mean, he's always in my back pocket, want to know some info. Uh, I always want to find out what I know, what I saw, what I thought of uh, his steps and stuff like that. So. Uh, he's going to be a great player. What really about Derek Moncrief? What have you been able to see from I mean, him? I was very excited to work with him. Uh, you know, he's a guy high energy, uh, flew around to the ball a lot. Can't wait to see him hit, though. Uh, I think he's a big dude, going to help us a lot. What do you think, Trevon, moving the defense, being back there with you guys? Uh, I mean, I always like Trevon energy. Uh, when he played often, he was the guy, you know, I went in for the get us pump and have a good day. And now he's on my side of the ball, so uh, it's going to be a long, long year for the uh, offense. <laughs> Not a lot of depth back there at safety, at least this spring. How you guys handling that? And what, what kind of coach has been telling you? Uh, honestly, I kind of think it's a good thing. We get to get a lot, guys a lot of reps. Uh, you know, I think that's the way to learn in this defense. You got you to gotta rep it and rep it and keep repping it. Uh, you know, as you saw, we got better throughout, throughout the season. So uh, I think that's, that's kind of a good thing. Uh, we're probably going to wear down toward the end, and, you know, we're going to take care of these bodies, though. Is Holsey kind of itching, wishing he could be out there? Most definitely. Uh, you know, he tried to get as many reps as he can, sneak some in there. You know, especially without the pass, and uh, he he he's been you know one of the better guys you know helping us uh, as far as what he saw you know what he think the offense gonna do because you know I think they put in kind of a lot today they hit it with a, a lot of different things today. Is it easy to stay hungry, Jermaine, after what happened in Pasadena? Is Most definitely. Uh, you know, you get to hear about it a lot. You always seeing it. Uh, the guys, you know, we we, we hungry. Uh, we know we're the hunted this year. <clears throat> a lot of guys can come out to our plate. And uh, we just want to want to make a statement and uh, live up to the expectation. You said they hit you with a lot of things. What 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 things did they hit you with? Today? Uh, I mean, you know, uh, coach has a lot of things in, in his playbook, and I kind of think he dipped and dabbed in a little bit of everything. You uh, you saw vertical, you saw the slant game, you saw uh, the inside zone, the outside zone, the quarterback keep. Uh, just just a lot of things in the offense that you know you probably would have thought he would have put in a little slower. What do you think of those new guys that received the Quill Williams and Stan Truett? Uh, I think, you know, Dequel is probably going to be a, a great player for this year. Remind me a lot. A lot of uh, Sammy uh, can get vertical fast, uh, but he also likes to put his foot in the ground and, and make plays across the field. Uh, and and Troy is going to be a good guy, quick with his feet, uh, great hand, uh, and a lot of com confidence out of both of those guys. So they're going to be able to help us real fast. Jermaine, you know, how would you compare you know, this spring to last spring, the first practice? Uh, like I said, last spring, I think, you know, it was a lot of finding out, you know, who our coaches were, what, what were we doing on the field, you know, how they wanted things to look. And this year, you know, the older guy kind of already had a perception of what things should look like. And we were able to, you know, pass that throughout to each other and get it down to the younger guys. And, you know, it's a whole different transition and being on the field and off the field. What do you want to get out of spring personally? Goal-wise, what, what do you want to accomplish this next, this next month? Me personally, I, I want to build a confident level. My teammates, uh, this shit gonna be a, a year we're gonna have to stick together. Uh, gonna be a lot, of, a lot of bumps and bruises throughout the road. And uh, I mean, I definitely want to get our confidence real high. Me personally, uh, I want to get my ball skills better. Uh, you know, reading the run, pad keys, especially in an offense like ours with, with a lot of misdirection and play action. I want to be able to, you know, make those great decisions uh, and not guess a lot of times. So, man, who worked at the boundary in the field safeties today? Could you walk us through the two deep thing? I think we kind of switched them up toward the end to see who could play, you know, what. But, you know, I was at field. Rudy Ford was at field. Uh, Brandon King was at field. Kahari Harden played boundary. Uh, and uh, Moncree played, played boundary. And uh, Van Gorda played boundary. Who, who got most work with the first team? I'm sorry, who got the most work with the first team today? Uh, me and uh, Moncree got the most work today. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it.